If you're having issues with the installation path while installing XEdit for Oblivion Remastered, this video is for you. If you go down to this description below, you're going to see I have in there this script right here. Go ahead and copy and paste the script into Notepad. Once you have it in Notepad, there are going to be two lines that we're going to be focusing on. These two right here. The first thing you're going to want to do is get the base path to the Oblivion Remastered. So for me, it is my C programs 86. So I'm going to go ahead and get that opened up. Programs 86. Steam apps, common and Oblivion Remastered. I'm going to go ahead and copy address as text and go back to the script and paste it. As you can see, nothing's changed because that was where it was installed. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to go to wherever you have XEdit installed. For me, if you followed the last video, you should know it's in my data folder. Once you're there, ensure that this name matches the exe that we changed in the last video. So this was originally xedit. We changed it to test4r.exe. Ensure that this right here says test4r.exe. Once that is done, go ahead and hit File, Save As. And this is where we're going to name this file test for our underscore launch dot cmd underneath it change this to all files once that is done ensure that you save it to your xedit folder wherever that is installed mine auto populated so i'm going to save it there go back to your xedit folder find the uh, script that we just made and we're going to left click it Xedit is now successfully installed for the Oblivion Remastered and you're good to go.